Cleotha Abston was sentenced to 24 years in prison after pleading guilty to especially aggravated kidnapping and aggravated robbery. The victim stated he was extremely lucky he was able to escape that night in 2000 when Abston put him into the trunk of his car at gunpoint for a number of hours until he tried to force him to use the ATM at a Mapco station. Someone had entered the gas station and the victim called for help. He wrote, it's quite likely that I would have been killed had I not escaped. Abston declined to comment in court. He was only 16 at the time of the kidnapping, according to his arrest ticket. Court documents state he had a good relationship with his family, but his childhood was rough. They go on to state Abston's lengthy record that shows his first arrest was in 1995 for theft. He was just 11 years old. He was arrested again and again every few months from there for burglary, theft, aggravated assault, violation of curfew, truancy, rape, evading arrest, and more. The violent crimes, including rape and aggravated assault, resulted in time in the detention center, but it's unclear how much time he spent there. His file also states at the time he had no suicidal gestures, medical problems, or mental illness. He was listed, though, as 100% violent. The 2000 kidnapping victim ended his statement to the court by saying, it was obvious to me, Abston feels absolutely no remorse for the crime. TDOC confirmed to us he was released in November 2020 when his sentence expired. Jessica Gortler, WREG, News Channel 3.